Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add a website to your custom GPT you have created. So as you can see, I have this AI news curator that summarizes top AI industry news and updates. And currently my company name is being displayed here, which is not bad, but what you want, but I think most people want with their custom GPT is that their website name should show up here under the custom GPT description. So how you can do that, it's really easy to do. All you have to do is click on your account name and select settings and beta and click on this builder profile. And here's where you're gonna be able to customize your a builder profile, which will be able to connect with user of your GPTs. And keep in mind that these settings apply to publicly shared GPTs. So what you have to do is add a domain here. So click on this down arrow, select verify new domain add your domain name and click on submit. And to verify the ownership of this domain, you have to navigate to your DNS provider and add a TXT record with this value. So, so let's do this. So click on this copy button, then go to your DNS provider and paste this TXT record there. So in my case, I can change my DNS records in Cloudflare, but if you don't use Cloudflare, it's probably Namecheap or GoDaddy or anywhere else where you have purchased your domain. And all you have to do is basically add the TXT record with this content that OpenAI has provided to you. And once you have done that, all you have to do is go back to your ChatGPT account. And let's see if we have successfully added this TXT record. So click on check here. And as you can see, your domain ryhex.com has been successfully verified. So click on done. And now as you can see, the website has been added and now we can turn this toggle on. And when we share this uh, public GPT, it should be able to show that uh, our website is ryhex.com. So let's check this out. If we go to uh, explore here and click on this one, as you can see, the website doesn't show up. And this is because this is not a public GPT. So we have to click on edit GPT here. We have to click on this update button and select public and click on confirm. And let's click on view GPT. And now as you can see our website shows up and uh, as you can see it's also a link. So it's a great way to uh, get some traffic from chat GPT. All in all, this is how to add a website to your custom GPT and also how to verify it. Hope you found this tutorial useful. If you want to get access to the custom GPT database and other free ChatGPT and AI resources, make sure to check out the links in the description below. And if you want to learn more about ChatGPT, custom GPTs, ChatGPT plugins, and other AI software, make sure to check out our YouTube channel and playlists because we have over a thousand free tutorials. And also make sure to subscribe because we have more tutorials coming up.